Alright, what is up everybody? Welcome back to Breath Edge. Did a little bit off camera. Some gathering, some crafting. Uh, put some air things out there. But I was wondering how to get through the radiation. And wish I had longer breath. And go faster. I actually found that stuff. Crafted it. We got a condom, which is an oxygen blows. That gives me a hundred oxygen now. Awesome. Accelerator. <laughs> this uh you get by combining frozen piss water with a rat and a burrito. It pretty much is a fart cannon. Pretty much what it is. Uh, crafted a scanner and a drill and stuff. Found a smuggler. But the enhanced space shoot will also give me radiation and a flashlight I found on the one debris. I didn't want to progress the story now, I just traveling around. But after all that, see we got ourselves a oh, that's how you that's how you pee. Uh we got a flashlight, self recharges. When we go out into space, I actually got a little boost. We're going to try to make it over to the fist pump there. I think that's the end of chapter one. I have so many wasted oxygen things around here. But I got the lead paint from in there. Yeah, I, I really. I gotta stop recording off camera more. I get carried away, I'm sorry. Give myself a little boost. Oh, look at that. I'm so sick. 55, 54. I'm usually out here at 20. Supposedly we do get a vehicle in this game at some point that we can go back and forth, back and forth. Oh, oh I do need to go in there. We're gonna we're, we're gonna refill here because I need a helmet. I think I need a helmet to fully get through the radiation, but we need glass, which in turn I need my grabber. I'm already starting to frost up. Oh yeah. So somewhere there's glass for me. Uh, we're gonna try to get over this heater. Classic extract. Very good. Very, very good. Is it this stuff? It is highly recommended that you not touch the glass fragments with your hands. Tiny splinters are able to pierce the thin fabric of the spacesuit and cause a slight death attack. Good stuff. I really did not mean to use my oxygen. I think I gotta go back. Like, I, I can't get over how ma majestic? Maybe? Is that the word I'm looking for? It's just amazing. Why am I frosting up? I'm nowhere near a freeze zone. I 
There we go. Oh. Sure, we we'll re refill. I like it. I like it a lot. That's a lot of coolant. Well, there's, I guess that's the main super reactor there or something. Whoa. I go up. Uh, let me grab some metal. Just in case. And I... Th I don't have a... Yeah, I have food, but I have no water. So we're gonna... Grab some water. Alright. Make a helmet, I hope. Uh, equipment, what am I missing? Lead paint. I have lead paint. Due to the high toxicity level of the renewed painting of the spacesuit, the probability of your death from radiation is now lower than the probability of death from the suit itself. In this regard, you can fly to the evacuation point. Thank you. I guess. Alright. Um, is there anything else I want to take? We're gonna take two glass, spare set of scissors. I'll take some salt, some honey. Made from alkali ordinary alkali water by natural alkalization. No, ordinary water through alkalization through the kidneys. Can I bottle the? the I bought all my pistols and use that to make batteries? That would be convenient. That would be very convenient. Alright, so I have no spare oxygen. But I'm fully suited up. Let's just rock it as fast as I can. Over and hopefully end the chapter. Because... I wonder if there's like a large boost. Well, I get, if you get to a vehicle, I guess there really is no point. You can just zoom around here. Zoom all the way back here. Pick up your stuff. Zoom all the way back forward. <laughs> Refill. Alright. Just gonna float for a little bit. Hopefully, get some uh, a good boost session.
65 oxygen. I have to go 800 meters. I don't know if this is going to happen. The captain's bridge is detected ahead. The evacuation should be led from there, but there are no signals or movement detected in this area. Probably everyone died. That's very comforting. Thank you, AI suit. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make that. I know oxygen is not limited. Do you have a spare container you're going to throw my way? I would really appreciate it. And I'm going to die. I'm so going to die. I don't think this mega kick's going to get me to 300 meters. With such an accent, the incorrect localization sounds extremely convincing. The information on the captain's bridge is classified in the database. Therefore, it is recommended to ignore this valuable advice and act according to the situation. Alright. I, I, do, I, oh, I don't think this is going to work. <laughs> I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> the captain's bridge was badly damaged, but the main systems are still functioning properly. Holy crap, that worked! <laughs> Wow. The door is locked. If you manage to get inside, there is a chance to send a distress signal to the nearest planet, or at least take the course with Captain who allowed this to happen. Wow, I cannot believe that happened. I have a key. Excuse me. Okay, then. Seems it will be a long day. You ain't kidding. While choosing the most painless suicide methods for you, a slight decrease in the background radiation was noticed. Surprisingly, your attempt to break the liner could lead to positive results. I could find out the nature of this phenomenon, but for that, I would need to disclose some confidential information of the Breath Edge Company, which contradicts the security protocol, so not a single spacesuit AI will disclose this information to you. On the other hand, this information is extremely necessary for us. There are a lot of stupid spacesuits with dead carriers floating around, so nobody will even know if you resort to the good old torture method, like the drill. No, no! I will tell you everything! I swear! Ah, don't do that! What was that? I offered for you to torture other spacesuits! It's a logical thing to do! Well, I won't utter another word. I don't know if I have the health. Okay, let bygones be bygones. I suppose you don't think that a program can be afraid of torture, do you? I don't think it can either, and I am definitely not hinting that you need to find an engineering shuttle. You probably need some explanations which you cannot get because the corresponding dialogues are absent in the game. Therefore, you won't get any. What? <laughs> what an a -hole. <laughs>
All right. In order to find out how you reduce the radiation, you need to calculate the coordinates of the place where the captain's bridge crashed into the liner. Red Edge Agency Coffins can help us with this. However, we still need to find an engineering shuttle, or even better, the engineer himself. There's an engineering shuttle ahead. I wonder how you find everything so quickly. Is it because of my hands? Electronics. So, new element gets introduced to the fray. Awesome. Not, but awesome. What are you? A titanium ball. Resin? Grabber. Okay. Almost ready to use fuel. All right, let's get inside before I die. Looks like he was shaving with a chainsaw during the crash. I can find no other explanation for such damage to a spacesuit. We need one that is in good condition, or at least other parts of this one. I'd recommend exploring the area. Juicy. Scan. So I need my scanner. I want to believe. <laughs> Switch off. Thank you. Ooh. Okay. So we got a new base operation. I can work with this. Nice. Ooh, more oxygen. Is there a bed? No. Two containers, though. That's not too bad. Fuel. You can make fuel from anything, especially if it's graduated from University of Chemistry. Let's chemist. Okay, I can make a steering wheel now. How do you get alkali? Seriously. Oxygen candle and an aluminum. A plain oxygen candle. Okay, so we're gonna put that on four. And I still have no freaking health. Okay. Yeah, let's go. Looks like there's nothing here. Examine some other debris. And I just use that. I just use that oxygen thing. I really need to mind where I click. I'm definitely going to explore that over there. This part belongs to the shuttle's owner, or owners. It's hard to tell whether the remains belong to just one person. In any case, this won't do. We need something below the belt, if you know what I mean.
Oh, I forgot. The alt key stabilizes you. Now what I need it, but something. Oh, scanner. Plastic rubber rubber. Rubber. Oxygen. I have a spare. What do we got? Battery. Magnet. Electronic stuff around here. Ooh, and resin. What's that? Is it the body part I'm thinking of? Oh, nope, it's just a finger. This won't do. <laughs> it was married, divorce. Okay. Um, I'm actually going to take that because I have a feeling I might need it for the fingerprint. What is this? I'm definitely taking the battery. Construction kit. Another scanner. Ooh, another burrito. All right, I need to go purge the inventory. What can we build? Oh, that's a suitcase. I don't <laughs> I don't need any more of that a flashlight um I need an oxygen candle oh you mix the titanium with it and some jet fuel sure I am gonna need metal that's not good Uh, let's get rid of some of this tape. Definitely some of that. These. A light bulb, a magnet. Stuff I don't think I'm gonna need. Which drill? No. Give me the, the better drill. I guess that means I can build stuff? Let's toss it in there for now So I gotta grab some aluminum. Doesn't look to be any on that rock. Ah, some over here though. Nope, that is an ice supply. There's the aluminum.
And my drill, apparently. Looks like there's nothing here. Examine some other debris. No, grab it. I hope we get a better uh, tools. That'd be nice. This one has one durability, that's really not even worth me taking. I'm gonna make one of those though. Okay, I have an extra. What does it, what does it make to take to make a drill? Frickin' battery. That's what it takes. I'm actually going to go back and explore this. But I'm going to set up one of these mildly in between. Or do I? Because the captain's top thing is capable of providing oxygen. Watch, there's nothing over here. I'm just wasting time. Definitely seems that way, doesn't it? Cutting it close. I don't think Yeah, I think there literally is nothing for me over here. It's just for that transition. Okay then. That way we go. Cyanide improved blood circulation and overall health. Do you have cyanide? Take it. Yeah, you're definitely an evil AI. It's not a question in my mind. Take a light bulb. All the interior was torn out by depressurization. Okay. 
The durability of the engineering modules is impressive. Even such asteroids couldn't crash them. What a strange place. But maybe we can find something useful here. sure if the engineer's legs remained intact, but we were lucky. Unfortunately, due to the security protocol, I cannot tell you that the special magnets built into his engineering boots can be used to immediately open the back panel of Red Hedge Coffins. You probably need some explanation about this. I have no right to inform you that Breath Edge Agency coffins exchange information with each other concerning obstacles flying by in order to avoid collisions in space. But collecting this information would help determine the trajectory of the captain's bridge, which in turn will determine the coordinates of its collision with the liner. Okay. Open a couple of coffins? Two... Hundred coffins. Two hundred coffins. I don't know, I'm picking up all these construction kits. Don't know if I should be or not. Repair tool? I know one all the way back at the start. There's like no hint. About where I can... Find some, is there? Part of the Breath Edge storage. There are only some empty coffins here. You can even choose one for yourself if you want to. This is a non-standard modification. Looks like somebody probably wanted to improve the speed characteristics of this coffin, which is a direct violation of the contract, although the idea is implemented quite well. Oh, I need a scanner. Two. Large accelerator. I am liking the sound of that. All right, let's get back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't care as much if I actually had a bed, you know, because my uh, get in my health pool isn't exactly the best. <laughs> Okay, so I need two Schwamba, two yellowish water, which are back at the other building. What is this? Removes nuts, screws, and someone's disobedience with a good strike. Sure. Oh, I need refined metal and thick electrical tape. Uh, we're going to put all these in there.
Right, I'm a scrapper. 16. Give me our scrapper. What is this? Thirty plus thirty. Right. Ooh, ice plus four. I like it. That takes up my whole damn inventory. Okay, so I only have one rat thing. I'm running out of oxygen and patience, but I have enough of first to survive for a long time. Wow. Just wow. I guess I don't need the eyeball either. Yet. I don't know why I'm carrying an eyeball around, honestly. Um I made the repair tool. Master key. Yes, 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 yes. I need a master key. Or is it no, that's not the repair tool. Confused. Thought I picked up the master key.
That's not there. No, it's right there. Aluminum. I'm missing a lot of the obvious stuff. It's a crowbar. Okay, so I got the two water. I just need another one of those taco things. And then we're gonna get the master key here. Back down to the bottom again. The technology of opening the back panel of Breath Edge Agency coffins is commercial classified information, and therefore I cannot advise you to turn on the magnet. Attack. You're doing great. You're almost there. Is that it? Oh, I was expecting like an animation or something. that these mechanics just artificially prolong the gameplay. Okay, now we gotta go find another coffin. Keep an eye on a radiation meter. What? Okay. Sure. Auto cleaners. I always thought of them as useless equipment, but seeing the size of this ball of debris they managed to roll, it makes me start to respect them. Wait, 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 wait. Is this where you start getting... The trash ball mostly consists of electrical tape. Like enemies? Wow, well, look, script for you. You only need three attempts. Are you sure you play playing like you pursue the game without any cheats? Uh, yes, my game is... Data acquired, but its analysis will take about three days. Ah, nope, three seconds are enough. Apparently, the captain's bridge damaged the tank with mayonnaise on the port side of the liner. The mayo got pulled into the core's gravitational field, which increased its mass and decreased its activity. Bombarding the core with other similar debris may lead to a further decrease in its activity, probably. What's left to do is to find something with similar properties to mayo and not fill yourself with such experiments. Regard, I will calibrate the radiation sensors a bit. You'll be able to get much closer to the liner, and we'll assume that you are not exposed to radiation at all. Speaking of Normandy, your interlocutor has already mentioned this shuttle with survivors. It would be nice to find it before you actually destroy everyone. I will mark several interesting places that I found through the Coffin notification system. Such supplies of electrical tape suggest that engineers doubted the durability of the liner. 
Wow. <laughs> That's funny. If you want to open more coffins, there's a chance that I'll be able to detect new, potentially useful debris while my anti-vandal program scares you with criminal liability. Judging by the steady melting of the rolls, there was a fire in the engineering modules, but it definitely was not thanks to your torture. I violated not only Breath Edge data protection protocol, but also entirely by accident. I repeat, entirely by accident. Crack the data block, which I had insufficient privileges to access. From the information gathered, I can conclude that the agency coffins not only transmit information about obstacles, but also exchange strange encrypted data packets. Unfortunately, even when threatened with a drill, I wouldn't have enough power to decrypt it. You would need some military equipment here. Okay. No idea where I'm going. Literally no idea. Bridge ball. Interesting. Okay, so I am completely out of oxygen. Is that one of my balloons? Wait, I got turned around down here. Wow, yeah, they are way off. I... How did I get turned around? Oh, well. Uh, scrapper. Nothing really worthwhile there. <laughs> oh my, that is awesome. And OBS is screaming at me that it's overloaded. Yeah, yeah, we're going back to the engineering bay, and that's going to be the end. But yeah... I think that is going to be the end for this episode. I'll catch you all in the next one. Hopefully this recording's fine. Judging my OBS yelling at me. Rubber. Definitely gonna go over and check that out. On the next episode. Good, good. So many light bulbs. But until that time, I'm gonna purge my inventory and call it a day.
I'd like to thank you all for joining me. And until next time, thanks for watching.